Hello, I am S. Ramachandran, Research Scholar from Bharat Institute of Higher Education and Research Chennai and presenter of this case study welcomes you for this August forum. The topic of my study is post-COVID-19 impact on the current trends of online marketing. My co-author and my guide is Dr. Rabiatul Basharia, Associate Professor from Lebanese French University, Erbil, Iraq. We, every one of us, known and faced the impact of COVID-19 in the recent past. Similarly, here we analyze the impact on the current trends of online marketing after COVID-19 lockdown period. During the lockdown period, the outside movement from residents were either arrested or blocked to meet the health and hygienic needs. Hence, to fulfill these needs, everyone explored the alternative ways and means. At that time, the alternative available was online buying only. So, most of them ventured this online buying process. The number of new consumers increased along with the existing one. This online buying was more convenient for the elders and seniors. Internet is the strong foundation for all online marketing. Since while surfing, internet online sites attract the viewers to view it. Always there will be some needs for everyone to fulfill. Surfing the internet creates the to buy things through online. In today's lifestyle, online marketing is the fastest growing market. Statistics as on May 20th from internet status indicates about 560 million internet users are there in India. This, this is equal to 40.6% of our Indian population. Internet and Mobile Association of India IAMEI report on November 19 says that about 504 million internet users in India were having used this internet for more than 5 years and 70% of them were daily users. This 504 million is equal to the total population of the four developed countries namely France, Germany, UK and USA. Internet users in rural area outpace the urban area. At any time millions of people surfing internet and all of them are potential consumers for online marketing. India is adding 10 million new internet users every month. The average surfing times were 3.5 hours per day and data usage is 9.8 GB per month. Existing 110 million online shoppers will double in 2025. The total online retail is 5% compared to the overall retail in India. Average online shipment, shipment per day is 1.9 million and 50% of them were metros. The average online shoppers spent 12,800 rupees as on 2019 and will rise to over 25,100 per year by 2030. Mobile continues to be the choice of device to surf internet for most of the consumers. Further to meet this requirement, popular online marketers develop their own suitable apps. These apps will occupy only very little space in the consumer's mobile. Hence, all the mobile users can use this app for easy buying through online. As per Times India study, 
the direct selling industry doubled its sales to 126.2 billion dollar during 2011 to 18 and estimated to reach 159.3 dollar billion in 2021 with a 4.8% compound annual rate growth whereas e-commerce market will reach from 53 billion dollar in 2018 to 100 billion dollar in 2020 with the annual growth of 33% with this similar growth rate it will exceed direct selling by 2022 when it comes to the figure indian will always beat the world record because of its population but gaining the consumer's trust is the challenging part as they were smart and play consciously once people started using internet their behavior changes permanently already two third of people in india have internet and accessing it several times in a week the objective of this study is to bring out major changes happened among the consumers mindset and highlight the changes in the volume of the business after the lockdown period the methodology adopted is to analyze the published information in the various sites and bring out the advantage of online marketing is many more and some main advantages are flexible convenient to do at any time at any place cost saving options are more etc details are given in the next two slides finding status before covid-19 and after lockdown period was tabulated in the next three slides few main changes are online sales volume is increased by 17% after the lockdown period this jump indicates lot of few lot of new consumers used online marketing amazon and flipkart seen 120 to 140 percentage growth in the shipment after the lockdown period before covid-19 respondents main priority was quality 48% price 47% and brand 24% whereas after the covid-19 respondents main priority shifted to availability 49% price 36% and quality 34% results and discussion generally indian shoppers are most con- cost conscious and conservative and not attracted by any promotion or advertisement in spite of that after the covid-19 outbreak and the subsequent lockdown in the country there was a major shift in the swampy behavior of the people as per the survey foreseeing consumers appetite for online shopping the survey results says there has been a surge in the use of online channel and the trend will continue even after the lockdown is lifted and the rise rising trend up to 64% from 46% over the next 6 to 9 months in online shopping covid-19 forced lot of new consumers to buy of essential goods through online during the lockdown period since they could not move outside their homes to buy products in the brick and mortar stores nearby they felt happy since this alternative online buying helps them to me their needs during this critical period their first convenience experience made them to do repeat buying habit through online buying so the 17% increase of order volume after the lockdown period prove the above statement 
the novelty of the study is to highlight the new added consumers current mindset towards online buying after the lockdown period conclusion all the online marketers have to ensure that every transactions are handled are hassle free one with easy return policy and try to satisfy these new consumers current mindset and retain them as their regular consumers in long run finally i want to thanks for your patient sharing thank you once again